February 26th was the last time All-American Argo Parker Essery touched her home floor here at the McLaughlin Center. But after half a season of pro ball in Perth, Australia, Essery is back and she's getting ready for another opportunity in Sweden. Five-time All-American just wrapped up her first professional season in Australia for the Perth Redbacks, averaging 13.5 points as well as 8.2 rebounds per game. However, Essery joined the team halfway into the season with only one practice under her belt was immediately inserted into the starting lineup for her first game. Spoiler alert, it went well, scoring 25 points and grabbing 15 boards. I got there, it was the practice, and then I had a game on Friday. I had one practice and then played our first game and we ended up winning, which was good. <laughs> I did good, which is also good. For anyone who's watched Esri play, there's never been a shortage of confidence, which is why that despite a whirlwind start and being undersized for a traditional post player playing professionally, she still gets the job done on the low block. Um, I think just no matter where I'm at, no matter what I'm doing, it's putting the ball in the basket, no matter who I'm against, you know. Esri will take the confidence to a new team at the end of September, signing with the Visby Basketball Club in Sweden where she'll be alongside a familiar face, reigning Frontier Conference Player of the Year and first team All-American from Rocky Mountain College, India Fly. India actually reached out to me because originally I was going to go back to Perth next season. I'm really excited. <laughs> Honestly, I'm like, I'm just going to have to get myself, like just find the open spot. You know, she's really good at creating space getting to the rim. Esri will get her first taste of a full season as a pro basketball player where she's excited to show up and show out in Sweden's premier basketball league. Now I'm starting a full season. I get to get like jump in the very beginning, be there from the beginning to end. Dylan Foreman, MTN Sports.